Fly vs Jörg 12 is brought to you by Alumacraft, fishing boats since 1946. Kingfisher Angelresen, fishing trips to some of the best destinations in the world. Drev.se, service and spare parts for your fishing boat. And JR Logistics, staffing and recruitment of truck drivers and warehouse workers since 2004. Ladies and gentlemen, we're sorry for leaving you hanging, but as we say in Sweden, if you're waiting for something good, you can never wait for too long. So without further ado, let's travel back in time to the Leech Gator boat right before lunch. Let's take these messy paper up again. What the hell? Was day two here? Yes! Hov! 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 Net, 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 net. Yeah, yeah. Are you with me? Yeah, yeah. It's a big one. It's a really big one. Okay. That's Alex. Yeah, it's a really big one. You see? Yes! 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 <laughs> That's what we came for! What? Yes! So fucking good! <laughs> On the catfish. It's a monster. Oh, my God. It's a, it's a 120. Love you. It's a 120 plus. I one plus. love you. Yes. <laughs> Woo yeah, guys, come on. That's a giant. Come on, no. <laughs> That's amazing. The camera. The camera. <laughs> we were just in the the moment they've been chasing room. for so yeah. many years, and finally they have her in the net. Catching a fish like this is something that most of us dream about doing maybe once in our lifetime. And to do it in Fly vs Jerk in front of the cameras, that's just pure magic. Oh. Uh, okay. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's over 120. Uh, it's over 12 kilo. It's nice, Alex. Yes! On the catfish. Okay. Oh, oh my, my new my. bait. On the catfish. Yeah. Really slow. Really slow. F me, that f felt good. Ah, we were just talking about it's going to be a rough day. Give me uh, this uh, things. Uh, I'm hooking. It's perfect. Yeah. That's a monster fish. Yeah, it's fat also. That's a monster fish, and fucking yes, we needed that. Yeah. It's over ten. It's twelve kilo. No, 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 no. Oh, it can be more. It's 12 kilo. Can we cut the hooks? Yeah, yeah. wait. Okay. Take that one here. Yeah. Okay. And take this one. Ah, it's okay. The catfish. Coming in the spring. Look. Look. Have you seen something like this? <laughs> Mamma mia. It's over 12 kilo. Oh, oh fuck me. Look it's it. a monster. Okay, okay. Oh, I think it's 120. Yeah. Okay. Oh. It's a good one. It's a monster fish. That, okay. Uh, are you with me? Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's a monster. Okay. It might be personal. Okay. I really want it to be stretched yeah. now. It's up to 126. Can we have it more? No. Okay, 126 here. One and a half. 126, yeah, 126 and a half. 126. Oh. Quickly here. Okay, in me. Okay, you have it? I yeah. take the. Oof. This is fly versus jerk, guys. This is wait, fly. Wait, wait, wait. Zero. I know, yeah. This is fly versus jerk. Okay. Over here. 14, 7, 14. Oh, fuck, it's so heavy. It's 14 point. Up, 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 up. Yeah. 14.8. In. Look at this. Look at this one. 
That, ladies and gentlemen, is what I call a real gator. 126 incredible centimeter, and when taking away the bag, we get an official weight of 14.02 freaking kilos. The biggest pike in the history of Fly vs. Yerk. That is an absolutely amazing fish, and we're deeply honored to share this moment with you. Seeing one of those monsters returning back to the depth is not something you get to see every day. Hats off for Team Leech Gator with Alexander Lexen and Markus Malyshevsky. What an accomplishment. Look it's it. a monster. This one. It's a monster. Ah. That's what we came for. That's what we f***ing came for. Oh. Now we are in the game. <laughs> now we are in the game. Yes. Okay. Let's go on because it can be a striking period. We we'll make all the okay. interviews later. Okay, crazy. And everything. My yes. My four, fourth bike over 120 this season. Uh. That's what we are here for. Okay. Uh. Oh, I'm so fucking happy. The catfish. <laughs> the catfish. I just no. Catfish. They want it slow. They want it slow. Ah, it's great. Okay, champagne afterwards. Now we need to focus because now we yeah. need three fish. I know. Get, uh, like if we can catch one big more and take two more, then we are in the top five. I don't even know where the clicker is, but what the fuck? This is going to be insane for the half report. They will just. Oh no. Let's take another one. Let's fucking take another one. That's good. Take a moment, Alex. High cost. I must sit down for a little bit. Yeah. It's kind of kind of fun because we were casting with jerk baits and that, and I I just I don't know what I, what, what I did, but I just I know I need to come deeper than. So I put on a, a 20 grammer, and I also put on a extra lead on, and I cast it out. And I let it sink and, and just a really slow retrieve on 12 meters. And it's just boom, <laughs> inhale the whole, the whole bait. The bait is like 35 centimeters. Really cool bait because you can also fish it really shallow with just a shallow screw. Uh, and it's got a, a little bit bigger tail than most, most of them, but we put on a paddle in the end. So you get like a slow with a little twist on the end. When the fish are fishing is slow and you need to fish it really, really slow. And that was the game for that fish. And we will see if we can catch one, one more big fish on this bait uh, today. Huge congrats once again for finally catching that monster. It was so well deserved. It took us 12 seasons to get the first 14 pluser in Fly vs Jerk. And I wonder when that will happen the next time. Now let's continue with episode 4. Okay, hi guys. Welcome to episode 4 in Fly vs Jerk 12. First, big congrats to Alec and Marcus. Super fish! Yeah, huge pike. For That's a, a amazing dream fish. fish. Dream fish on competition is it's crazy. Like uh, it is. He must be so happy with that fish. Yeah. So But we still believe yeah. we are in the lake and we are here for one big bite. Yeah, but it's we know it's they're really swimming tough. here and uh, we're gonna do what we can with our guy and pig sheds. <laughs> yeah. And um, you have the spotted bullet? Yeah of course and this one always devil is something so uh, Look, it's totally destroyed from the pre-fishing and everything, so yeah, hopefully. But the, it's tough, you know, we see the fish on the screen, they are there, there's bait fish there, but you yeah. really have to pass near the fish, they, yeah. they're we not are, active at all. Actually, we have uh, three small bites, but they are nibbling, yeah. like this, Doof. Yeah. So we really need to take the lure slowly in front of the mouth, otherwise they, they don't take. No. Exactly. No, it's really tricky. Okay. Okay. Let's take something now. Yeah. Welcome back. Episode four. Freezing my ass off. <laughs> yeah, but you know, it was so well deserved that Alex caught that yeah. fish. He worked uh, really hard for it. I know that. And uh, you know, that's, it's an awesome fish. It's a giant. So it would be really hard to get that, but we still have two points. 
So, so we, you have numbers points yeah. with six pikes, this no is other. nothing. And uh, we have uh, only 435. I was aiming for 440, so uh, <laughs> if we do our job, we can get one of these points. Yeah. Let's so we go. just need to, you know, uh, man up, and stay focused. Fish. Exactly. Let's do this. Go, my friend. First cast. <laughs> Boom. Okay, so more the pressure went up a little bit. Yeah. Right now we have two points, so we are sharing the first place with CBC yeah. right now. And but our score is not hard to beat. No, no. For the other guys, which makes it even harder to predict what's gonna happen. I think that a lot of the other teams will uh, go for numbers right yeah. now because that's the easiest way to get one point today. Yeah. What comes to numbers, we are not that far away. To Should we numbers. try to get numbers? I don't know. I think first we need to get the five fish on the boat over 75. I mean, it's the I most know. amount of fish is six. Yeah. Should we just drop down to the weed line and see if we can catch some small ones? Just for yeah, see yeah, if they're active. Try. Yeah, yeah. If I mean, they're active. Usually okay. the other side is, is better, but let's try from here. I mean, if they're active, fast. we can catch 20 fish quite easy. Yeah. Then we have a chance for a, That's the easiest point now. Yeah, yeah, that's I mean, true. the biggest one we're not going to catch from this lake. No, no. We can definitely catch the, the top. Top, top five. Yeah. Okay. Come on, man. Let's fight. Welcome back to Fly vs. Jörg. We just got the report and Huge, huge congratulations to Team Gator, Leech, Alex with a giant, giant, giant fish. Uh, that really, was really, 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 really cool. Fish of a lifetime, so uh, big thumbs up. Now we are back with a new spot. Lots of rocks, high grass, it's three meter under the boat. And we go first cast, boom. Hello everybody, welcome back to Team Ray Marine Diver. We're still going for the number points for the top five fishes, even though we have heard about this giant fish on 14 kilos. Uh, but you know what, this, there are still swimming fish bigger than 14 kilos in this lake also. So we're not out of the game yet for the biggest fish, even though it will be very hard. Yeah. But, uh, but we're still in the game really, really good for the top five fishes. So uh, stay with us and uh, follow us during this afternoon. Yeah, yeah Buster, now we take the first cast. Yeah, clear fish scanner. Three more fishes, Per, come on. Yeah. The average size is good here, so we have a ch chance up to 500 centimeters, I think. Yeah. Here we have bait fish. Mm. Come here. Yes, yes, yes. Fish? Yes, we're on. Huh? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Net, Per, net. This is not a big pike, but we must make sure to have our five pikes. So, hey, if I feel, oh, fuck. <laughs> wrong species. We got a sander. Per, be quick with the spray can. Make it green. Ah, again, close, but no cigar. Hmm, that one won't give you any number or top five point. But Per has another idea. Maybe it's a. You want to eat it? Yes. This one we can have for dinner. This was a wrong species. This is a sander buster just caught. But it's a beautiful fish to bring home to eat. So I, I will actually keep this one. <laughs> How Fuck, mister. Uh, really, really big strike over there. I thought I had weed on the hook. So I was reeling really, really fast. And it almost took my rod away. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I feel miserable again. <sighs> I thought I was going to lose my rod. Actually, it was so hard strike. Oh, oh. damn! Oh, the story of my life, Mr. Strike. It's not that my hooks aren't sharp, because I, I've looked at the hooks many times and I looked where I placed the hook and they are, they are razor sharp. It's, it's uh, super hooks from Daiwa, Teflon coated and everything, so they are super sharp, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. You know, we're in the pike fishing for the strike. And I have had several strikes, amazing strikes today. So, so somewhere deep inside, I'm still happy. But I would like to see some more pikes inside the boat. Mm. 
Yeah. Is it on? It's not a... Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. It's not a giant. It's not a giant. Yeah, but get it. Okay, second fish. Okay, this pike was following the lure beside the boat. And I saw yeah, it I saw coming, coming and <laughs> stopped retrieving the bait. And it took like super slow. The water temperature is so low at the moment. So I think they need slow retrieving and uh, super big stops and long stops. And second fish for us. And it's 79. Okay, 79 centimeters. Second fish. Let's put her back. First landed pike after the phone report. Well done, Posse. And now Jacob is hooked up as well. This is a good fish. Come on, Jacob. Yeah, we've got this. We've got this. You ready? I'm Coming ready. Now. I'm ready. Okay. Ah, oh, good. Good, Jacob. You know what I did? What? You just let it drop. Yeah. And when I was starting to reel, really, it was there. Ah, oh, it's perfect. Boom. It smashed it, man. Completely smashed it. Snaskarborren does it again. This time in a Wolf Creek shad. Awesome stuff. Let's measure this one, man. Ninety there. Ninety. Yeah. It's ninety. Awesome. Beautiful fish. Kiss it. Kiss it. No. <laughs> That no, I, I ain't kissing fishes. I'm kissing women. <laughs> really? Boom! 90 fish. Let's get one more. And I'm not freezing anymore. We went into the shoreline to see if there were any numbers game here, but we didn't have a single one. So we went out again and we're gonna stick to the plan. We came here for one reason. It was to get a big top five. We felt like everything was on fire there for, <laughs> for half an hour, but it just as quick as turn on, it turned off, you know? So uh, now we're looking for bait fish and uh, single fish that are spread out on the sides here now. And um, hopefully we can just continue catching these fish, you know. We know that Headbangers is going to be really the team to beat. Marcus and Emmanuel, they have some really nice fishing up there and they, they really know their fish up there. So they're going to be really a hard, hard competitor on top five. But that's what we're gaming for today. Uh, and then tomorrow we're going to give you a really cool show. But uh, see if we can get that top five first. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I'm going. I'm gonna have to change the direction of the electrical engine though. No, 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 no. Bro, please. He dropped, but now I'll pull me a loop on. Yeah, this is the... This is a good fish. And I did not get the hook set because I was changing the electrical engine. No, maybe it's not so big actually. It felt better. Will it help us? Ah. Oh. <laughs> it's just fat. <laughs> yeah, I think that nice. might help yeah. us. Okay. At least yeah. that's a, it's another number point. Yeah, it will help us for sure. I actually thought oh. that that one was much bigger. It felt really heavy. It's fat, that's... <laughs> it's really fat, that's good. 81. It won. Yeah. Great. Okay, healthy fish. Let's release it. Bye bye. That's an upgrade and a clicker. Some pike slime in the beard. That's good stuff. That's an upgrade. Nice 81 centimeter pike for Team Headbanger, giving them a 3 centimeter increase. Right now they're leading big time on the top 5, but they might need every centimeter they can get if any of the other teams would fill their paper. With a 126 centimeter monster in their bag, Team Leech Gator have a very solid base for a great top 5. The fish seem to be active, so Alex changes back to the Gator Jerk to cover more water and fish shallow over deep water. Yeah, good Alex. This is a little bit better. Okay, I'm coming. Uh, hold it down, hold it down. Yeah, yeah. Hold it down. Oh, no, f me. It's so strong. Yep. Good Alex. Oh, yeah. Are you with me? Yeah, yeah. I think it's, it can be 90. That's good. Okay. 
Yeah. Oh, it's loose. Loose. It was strong. It's like a anabola pike. <sighs> oh, it's really nice. It's a. Uh, oh, it's over 90, I think. Maybe. Yeah. It's a 90 fish at least. Okay. Over here. It's almost 100. Okay. Wait. Hold it there. I fix it yeah. here. Do you have it? Yeah. I have 100.5. 100. 100. 100. So. Yeah. One meter fish. <sighs> Oof, it's really nice. Now that's one chunky eating machine. Well done, Alex. You already hold the big fish point, but this is exactly what you need for your top five. Caught on gator jerk, motor or bur burbot. Release her back. So now I will report this. You need to rewrite everything. Yeah. 83, 219 plus it's 309. 309 on three fish. So now we need, if we can catch one more meter fish or two, huh? then we are in the game. Because we need, if we get 295s, we have five meters. Yeah. And that will be hard for anyone to beat. In these conditions, yeah. Let's do it. Looks like bigger fish are active now. Yeah. Nej! Oh, Mr. Strike. Vilka hugg, Per. Jag skojar inte. Det där var ju, det där var ju liksom döda grejen. Det är rätt roligt. Ja. Alltså, jag känner ju att jag är, det händer ju när som helst. Men eh, det gör ju inget om det sitter ner i svalget på en tolva nästa fisk. Eller hur? I'm trying with the laser jerk 15 cm. With the lead in the front. Uh, and the, in the fire tiger color, it's about the same color that uh, Buster uses for his uh, soft. Now we have a fish. Ah, uh, 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 not on the bottom. I'm not so happy now. Ah. Jag vet inte så jävla sur kan man missa flera i rad. Det är en sak att man missar en och så tar man den. Alltså det är något som är... Som jag, 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 jag borde ju kunna ha gjort någonting bättre, men jag vet bara fan inte vad... Där, där! Har du? Nej! Akta spöt. Ta den igen, Buster. Eller så sätter du på nya krokar bättre, eller sätter de på under eller någonting. Buster. Put on bigger hooks or something. Cast again. Be strong. I love you. <laughs> Don't go. Oh, I hate these pikes. Oh. Not again. Oh. Pick it up again, cast. Yeah. Come on. Oh. <sighs> uh, I don't know if I have the strength in my body now. <laughs> that was also a big fish that I missed. Oh. What? Yeah. You know, you only get so many chances. You know, it's not like like there are swimming 10,000 hungry pikes here. Oh, scheiße. This fish, it was uh, the last fish I, stri I, I lost was strike and just when the soft bait was turning, I was uh, reeling it in towards the boat. So it came from nowhere and I get to see the back on that pike when it strike and it took the soft bait. And uh, yeah, that was one fish we needed. That was a good fish for us. Very good fish. But uh, hey, there's more pikes in this lake, so uh, maybe the luck will turn. The bit of hick. Now we take another fight. Now we do something else. I don't shit, Buster. Folk kommer tro att jag är värsta jävla soppan. Kan krocka en jävla liksom. Kanske är det så. 
Kanske är det så. Fuck, jag inte upp där farsan. Kan man ha sån här otur? Alltså helt ärligt, vad fan gör jag för fel? Vad gör jag för fel? Var, varför, varför sitter inte jäddarna på kroken? Du får dem i alla fall att hugga. I don't know who I'm feeling the most sorry for. Buster who misses them or Per who doesn't get them to bite at all. One thing is certain, if they had caught all those pike, they'd be in the game for both their top five and the number point. Fan, vet du vad som vore roligt? Nej. Det är om det snöade lite till. Careful what you're wishing for. Det är helt sjukt. I just love those, you know, breezes that come yeah. from time to time. Bringing, you know, shit loads of snow. Makes just, you feel alive, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just love it. Ah, oh, no. You miss it? I don't know. No. What is this I have? This is a fish. <laughs> this is so strange. I don't know if this is foul hooked or something. I don't care. It feels strange. Just bring it, it in. Feel, it feels too strong. No, no, no. This, this is a fish. This is okay fish. I think it's approved. Jacob and Björn have three approved pike of the paper and are in desperate need for two more. This seems to be exactly what they are searching for. This, this is nice fish. <laughs> I'm a little bit warmer now. <laughs> boom! There, there was no boom. No, that was so strange. Yeah. Nice! Yes! Well done! Thank you! This could be 90, man. Uh, yeah, 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 it could be 90. And of course... Jigen, Snaska Jösen. Okay, let's measure this lady now. Oh, she's nice. She's over 90 for sure. Oh, hell yeah. I have 93. Ah! Awesome. This is a little bit bigger than the, the other one, but it's not a 14 kilo fish. But she had... Look at the fins. She's yeah. been in a fight. Yeah, she's been in a fight. Awesome pike. That's uh, number four. One more and uh, we're in the game. Yeah. Well done. The battle of the top five point continues and with this 93 centimeter beauty, Team Jiggar.nu reclaims the second place on the top five board with 356 centimeters. Now they're just one approved pike away from stealing the lead from Team Headbanger Lures. Well done. Okay, now we let her go. Oh yeah. <laughs> that was a different one. She did a pirouette and then went straight down. Ooh, it's so warm. <laughs> it's so warm. Take them. Yeah. One more. One Boom. more. One more yep. and we're uh, we're in the game. Yeah. We're 90, one more 90 fish and it's okay. Yeah. And you know that number point is up for grabs. That would be hard, really hard to get, but we're still. Anyone who has the water to to actually take down numbers right now should do it. Well, we do have two fish in what? 20 minutes? Yeah. So. Oh. Yep. Marcus and Emanuel can feel everything but safe about their number point. They're leading with seven pike, but the other teams are breathing down their necks and the fishing has been really slow for them after the lunch report. Now Emanuel has spotted a nice fish on the stoner, but it doesn't really seem to want to eat. Does the fish stand near the bottom? Yeah. A little bit to the right, straight in front of the boat. It's 7.5 meters deep. This one is for me, come on. Just because you see them doesn't mean you'll get them to bite. Over in Finland, CWC fishing team still haven't caught a single fish and they're struggling with the exact same thing. They're fishing a really good lake with lots of big fish and have found a massive school of bait fish in deep water with hungry predators around it. They're casting and casting, trying different lures and colors, but no matter what, they just don't seem to be feeding today. Until... Yeah, fish! Small one. Oh, no, it's okay, okay. The first fish of the day! Yeah, yeah, there, there. Yeah, 
It's quite, it's kind of fat for the size, huh? What? It's nice looking fish. It's kind of fat for the size. Okay, first bite. For us, was quite tough. This lake. We have only a couple of, couple of small bites, but now it's first fish in the boat, so it's, it's nice. It's nice to see a fish, and this one take it quite good on the spotted bullet, the giant pig shad. It's a lovely fish. Yeah, it's not huge, but around 90, 95 maybe. Nice pike, beautiful fish. Yeah, it's 93 centimeters, so it's a nice fish, you know? First fish, yeah, and it was a good fight too. Now we're going to pull it back and try to get uh, another one. Ah, oh, feels nice. You know, finally a fish, you know, after I don't know how many casts, we tried the whole place there. We have a couple of small bites, but nothing happened. But now we have a fish, at least we get something, you know, so it's it's better than nothing. And 93, it's a decent pike, you know, for, for a day like this. Nice, super cool. So we have still some time to fish, or so we're going to insist there. We have some bite and uh, yeah, hopefully for something bigger than, than this, but yeah, sounds good. There we go, first fish of the day for CWC fishing team. The only team still at zero is Sportfish Kegigante in Sporting, but finally they also caught their first pike of the day. Yep, a bicycle pump and the gator gum. It has been a tough day today again. Shit, pump fritz. Oh, come on. First fish for a team Sportfish Kegigante in Sporting. It's a bicycle pump. Again, it was a nice strike anyway, so it was not the biggest one in this lake, but uh, after a very tough day, I have to say I'm quite happy anyway. Let's go and take another one. Oh, yeah. Got it? Yeah. Oh, good. It came after the fly, then I, then I just dropped the fly back. I, I saw that. <laughs> Oh, that was funny. It's over 75, but it's, it's not a big one. You ready? Now it comes. Now it comes. Ooh, mm -hmm. I think it's 85, maybe. Okay, good. Uh, well, uh, uh, it's 75 at least, but. Yeah. Good job, man. Definitely what we needed. <sighs> now it's actually quite small. Sorry? I'm gonna try. It's even 75. I think it's 75. Oh, you think so? Yeah, it's 75. It's actually, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, it's 81. 81. Our third fish for the top five. It's not a big one, but at least something. And there she goes. Good man. That was fun. It was following all the way to the surface, and then I just I dropped, dropped, dropped yeah, the fly down. Dropped the fly and boom. Again. We got three fish, two on the paper. We keep on hammering, now we go into the deep holes and look for the bait fish. We try the shallow areas, but it doesn't hold any fish there. We try to fill the papers with five okay fishes and go for the numbers. That's our chance. Let's do it, Pasi. Let's do it. Okay, we're on now. We change the location. We find the deeper part of this lake. It's a really big lake, but you can see here, it's bait fish and predators everywhere. So uh, I think if they start feeding now, when you get fish out here, it's gonna be really, really big ones. So it's coming bait fish and, and predators under the boat. You can clearly see it here on the Lawrence HDS size 12 live. Let's get them, Pasi. Yeah. Two o'clock report. We have Four fish, biggest one 4.7 and top five 356. And the two report, we got seven in total, 438. So now we are hunting for to fill uh, fill the paper up because we have three decent fish. We need two more to actually have a chance on. I think we have a good chance if we if we catch two more decent fish. And uh, on pre-fishing we caught a, we didn't make much time here, but we caught a 93 here bait fish. on the 6 meter curve. So we will try this place and hopefully we will catch one. And then we go to another place that we haven't fished yet in uh, this. So we go there and see if we can wake the mama up there. On the right side. Yep. And it's standing in the middle water. Now, please. I've been casting there, but... What? 
I've been casting all the way. Yeah, yeah. but it didn't Fuck. want yours. It's not mine. <laughs> <laughs> Please yeah. take it now so I can say it. Properly. When you are on fire, you are on fire. I'm the first net guy today. <laughs> Yeah. Good, Alex. Yeah. This is good. Yeah, I think it's good. Okay. Yeah, we need that. Oh, no, down, 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 down. That's uh, 80. More, I think. Important one. Damn, they take Make the a mark on the GPS uh, down there. What do you think it is? Catfish. It's the monster catfish. <laughs> Fucking good bait. <laughs> one more. One more. One more. Oh, it's more than 80. It's wait, 88. Okay, you see, over 88. Yep, a nice 88 centimeter pike, and we need that pike. Uh, we need one more bigger fish this day, then we maybe can take uh, the five points. Took it on the catfish. The plan is playing out really well for Alex and Marcus, and with that fish, they're passing Team Yigardatnu on the top five board for a second place. They will 99.9% .9 most likely get the big fish point of the day, and now the top five point is just one approved pike away. And guess what? One more pike would also give them the number point, and that, ladies and gentlemen, would put them in a very strong position when going into the final day of the competition. We have six fish, and we got an 88 now, so we have 397. 397. I on know four it's picks. a big score. Yeah, and they have 435 on five. I know. So we like if we catch our 80, 90 fish, uh, we are in the game. Stay tuned. I'm hunting, and I feel good. Let's do this. One fish more. We make a crazy thing now. We haven't uh, caught anything deep, and we found really, really huge amount of bait fish. The bait fish is uh, from the top all the way to the bottom. It's 47 meter right here. And we're gonna <laughs> fish baits, Google runs, three or four meter on the surface. We have nothing to lose, we're catching nothing, nowhere we're going, so now we're going for the bait fish. See if we can catch a big mama around the bait fish. Let's do it. I have to show you this color. Smoothen on uh, the stain uh, bull teeth. Extremely nice. I think this can work, you know, black belly and this clear blue thing. I think the fish will see it if it's 47 meters deep. Come on now, Rickard and Stefan, bring us a real pelagic monster. The chances of presenting your lure right in front of a pike on those depths is not the best, but if you succeed, you might be up for a dang good reward. Team Vision are working on the top five, and Niklas just changed fly just to try something different. <laughs> you gotta be <laughs> Nice. Hey! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> Well done, Niklas. Okay, this is this nice. It's yeah, I would say nice. same size as the first one. Yeah, maybe, maybe. A 95. Getting somewhere. Okay, new color. Yeah. Black, red. Maybe the fish are getting active now. Yeah. But it, they should get active. Yeah. Now you know you. That's good. Nice fish. So on the Hoover fly, this one actually took it quite well. So it's on the big hook. I think that's close to meter fish. You need uh, flyers. No, nope, it was perfectly hooked in the side. It's, uh, it's 90, 94. 94. Nice fish. Good for the top five. Now we only need one more for the top five. And good. There's the back. One more. Uh, one more. Bye. Okay. Good I job. Think that was the fish I saw in the in the sauna. Side of you. Yeah. Yeah, you saw it. Yeah. yeah. Super cool. Okay. Let's continue. Let's continue. Now we have only one missing and yeah. then, then, then we start to upgrade. We now have three teams closing in on Headbanger with four approved fish on the board. One approved pike from any of these teams and Headbanger will lose their point. As if this wasn't enough, both Gator and Vision are only one pike behind the number point. Marcus and Emanuel haven't caught a fish in hours and if they don't fire up again very soon, they risk losing both of their points. No pressure boys. What do you think? Do you think uh, we still have some of the points? Uh, <laughs> I hope so, but uh, it's not I, easy. I don't think we have the number point. I would be surprised 
if we had the top five, but we have increased at least one fish. It was not a lot, but uh, one, one more long fish would feel really, really good to at least have some confidence that in that there would be a chance. Yeah, to like, get the like point. one uh, big fish, like over 105 or something like that. Yeah, one five, one ten. Would be really that would nice. feel nice. Uh, I just had a strike and I was casting uh, against my waypoint I made on my uh, Raymarine Axiom. Uh, and it's very useful to mark when you have a, a, a nice fish, uh, to mark and go there again to cast on the same spot. I'll try to... Yeah, it's on. It's on? Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Is it a better fish? I don't think it's big, but maybe... It's a fish. Maybe... Little bottom, so you know about it. Nice cool. fish, or? Oh, I think, I think we, you... We need to measure it. It's very big, but I think it might be net. Yeah, that was... Yeah. That's a competition fish. I think so. Finally pair, super <laughs> nice. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. Yeah. How long it is. Okay, nice fish, 82 centimeter. Now we need to keep on uh, casting, Buster. Yeah, yeah. Get, get on it. So the situation right now is still to catch that last fish because we really want to fill the paper with five good fish because we think we can probably steal that top five point also. Uh, it's important for, for the last day. Uh, so we will do all the best to catch that big fish. I think it would be nice to have a 103. Alex said that. Then he stopped fishing and I on, will only continue. He promised that. No, it's just a matter of time before someone catches the fifth approved fish. Up in northern Sweden, Jacob just got hooked up and if this pike is 82 centimeter or longer, they'll steal the top five point from Headbanger. This is a good fish. Come on, Jacob. And we've got this. We've got this. You ready? I'm Come ready. I'm ready. Yes! Perfect! Boom! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oof. I saw the strike. That was so cool. You saw the strike? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made a cast over its land over there. And it just came out there like one meter and just smashed it. Hanky <laughs> <Dang it. laughs> <laughs> Booyah! Do we have a meter? I don't think so. Uh, yes, yes, it could be a meter. No, it's gonna be it, This is close. It's this is high tight. 90. So, one more of those, and we're really in the game. <laughs> Best feeling in the world. This is a big head. I saw it. Ah. Cool. You ready, Björn? Of course I'm ready. No. 91. Yeah? Yeah, 91. Okay. Really nice. Really nice. With that large-headed 91-centimeter gator, Team Jigga.nu have officially filled the paper with five approved fish and a top five of 447 centimeters. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new leader on the top five board. Very well fought, guys. We have 440... 440... 447. 447. That's, that's freaking good. Ah, right, that's good. Condition. Okay, let's let her go back. We have 90, 91, 92, 93, right? Yeah. So 94 then. <laughs> A pike straight. Jacob! Yes. F***ing well deserved. Now we have a paper. We do, we do, we do, we do. And the best part is that we still have time. Now we just need to switch that 82 for a bigger pike. Yeah. Oof, what a feeling. Ah, good job. Filled paper. Check. Oof. I can tell you, when, we, when you have all of this on, your hoodie and, and everything, now I know how a horse feels. Horse? <laughs> yeah, with his eye shades. Oh, so. <laughs> I, he said, view, 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 and I was like, whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, you, you were really quick there. So much, but it has to be some pike around this. So much bait fish. Oh. But it's, it's quite big bait fish, it's nice. It has been very quiet from the CWC boat this afternoon. They're struggling with extremely challenging conditions, totally inactive fish and a game plan that turned more or less impossible after the phone report. They went all in for one big fish but catching a pike bigger than 14 kilos is frankly speaking not extremely realistic. Changing to numbers is not an option and the chances of getting a top 5 doesn't look very bright either. Now they're thinking about quitting early to spare some energy and time for the famous river day. Yeah, I don't think we're going to fish that late because we have a big, big, big now traveling. Uh, we're going to a nice river and we absolutely need some point tomorrow. So stay tuned and see you, see you there. Guys, big surprise in the boat. I'm changing color. You didn't think that time would come. It's getting dark. I want the bait with some better contrasts. I'm gonna change to the black orange. It's a bait that's also been working very good for us during test fishing. I have good confidence in this color as well. Black silver is, as you might, may have guessed, of course my favorite, but this time I think this one is a better choice. Now, last hours of light, we hope for a big one. I've had a few of my biggest fish in the dark, actually, so I'm confident in this. I switched for the catfish but now I'm switching back again for jerk because we really want to search uh, the difference, the fish in uh, different two ways of depth. So the jerk will be higher, much higher up and Alex is gonna fish more deep and on the bottom. So we have two options for the pike to strike. Okay, let's go. Maybe, let's see. Ah, uh, it's not too big. Oh, we can't measure that one. Uh, it's too ah, small, you can see it here. Damn. Small one, but a pike. Right now, every single jack is probably way more important than the contestants think. Team Headbanger Lures are leading with seven pike, but have three other teams with six pike. Never before has the number point been resting on such shaky ground. Nu. Fisk. Ja, fast det är en liten. Fan, Per. Ah, now it's getting bigger. It was swimming towards me. Yes. It's not big. But still, we need it. Oh. So Klein. Too small? Yeah, too small. Okay. That's not what we're looking for, but maybe we could we can. use it as make sure. Hey. Oh, I missed the strike. Again. What the hell? 69. Too small. So we let him go back yeah. again. But it's a clicker. Yeah, I just missed a, missed a strike when pair were handling the fish, so uh, I think we're on something now again. So uh, if we keep on hammering this place, I, I think we'll get more pikes. A small pike for a man, but an important one for the number point. And we now have a tie between Raymarine and Daiba fishing team and Headbanger Lures, who both have seven pike on the board. The rules state that if two or more teams have the same result, they both get one point. There are still about two hours left to fish and things can change very quickly. Ladies and gentlemen, four o'clock, 447 centimeters. Oh, that's a big pike. What? Oh, that's a big pike just in front of the, of, of the boat. There, there, there. See it? No. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yep, now we fished uh, two hours in the deep water. No bite, no follow, no contact, nothing. We went uh, down to the south end of the lake now, fishing some rocky points, some underwater reef. Now I'm gonna try the new um, beast tail from Avogasia. Let's do it. Over in Finland, Truman and Pierre are throwing in the towel for today. See you on River Day. Meanwhile, Team Leech Gator are changing spot. Yeah, so uh, we have fished this uh, place now. And um, it's kind of hard now because the wind died. So we are going out to the big lake and uh, the wind is pushing in uh, a little bit. And we have caught some fish there, like uh, around 90 and 100. I think the biggest was 107. So we will try to go out and catch because we need one. I think we need one like 90 fish now to be, not to be safe, but to have a good chance to uh, take uh, top five. We go for that now. Go, 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 let's do this. 
team Headbanger Lures are also on the move. They had a great start of the day, but the afternoon can only be described as a disaster. Are you tired, Marcus? I'm just resting. Resting for next spot. Okay, guys, we just arrived to our new spot, uh, which is actually the same spot that where I lost the uh, better fish earlier today. Now it's Colossus time. It's been a real killer for us this autumn on big fish. I will go with the, the rainbow color and uh, hopefully it will get a huge strike. And it's quite similar action to the smaller headbangers. This one have a slightly yeah, mm, slower like uh, slower action, moving a little bit slower side to side. Like a S curve, yeah. but with some headbanger shakes to it. And uh, of course it moves a lot of water, so the pikes nearby will know it's, it's there. This is a good fish. Come on, Jacob. Oh, yeah. Ready? Yeah. I don't it's think not it's a big 90. fish, but it's an upgrade. Good job. Yeah. It's a fatty, but is it long enough? I don't know. 83? Yeah. 83, so it's a small upgrade. Two centimeters. Let's put her back. Thank you. Awesome. Good, Jacob. Yeah. That felt good. Fish number six. Took it on, on a drop or, or... Yeah. Is that pike number six? Yeah. Okay. Welcome to the official six pike club, Jacob and Bjorn. One more and you'll share the number point with Headbanger and Diva. Yeah. Nope. Either touch, please. Yep. Thank you. Number seven. Number seven. Way to go, Jigar. Without knowing or even trying, you just joined Headbanger and Diva in the numbers club to snatch your second point of the day. This means it's a tie between Jigar and CWC in the total with two points each. The heat is on. And if, if anyone was going for big fish point today, they will not be happy after this last report. Yeah, there might have, might have been some tactic changes after lunch. Yeah, but it depends on what waters you're fishing. I know. You know, sometimes you cannot change it. If, you, if you're going for, for top fish, you cannot change it to numbers. That's usually it's not, it's very, very hard. And the top five point is, is the point that everyone goes for. Either you go for numbers or big fish, you still go for five. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. So that's a tough one. But you still need to find these, these fishes that we caught today. The 90 you know, fish. Yeah, the 90 yeah. fish. They are really hard to find, lots of them. Yeah. Usually there's a, they're rough, around 70 or 80. But then you catch a meter fish or something. But mm. still, to have this high 90 or low 90, this is hard fishes to catch. Usually to get over 460, 470, you need a, a big fish. Yeah, you need that kicker fish, of oh. course. Talking about having a nice kicker fish in the bag, Team Leech Gator are still chasing their fifth pike for the top five. They are slowly running out of time and are now putting their last hope in one final spot before calling it the day. Oh, fish! Quick, 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 quick. <laughs> still strong, motherfucker. <sighs> oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's, the <laughs> That's the top five fish, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> Mamma mia! Oh. What the hell? That's Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Spotted bullhead. That always is the perfect lure later in the night. Whoa, what a take. Just came from under, you know, like <laughs> boom. <laughs> Motherfucker. <sighs> Spotted bullhead, gator gum. Works every time. All right, Alex, ready for measurements? This, let's hope, is a, a high 90 on this one. I think it's a 90. It's a really but important fish a, for us. It's so important, Mark. No, it's more than 90. I hope so. Yeah, it's one meter. Uh, it looks like that. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Wait. There. There we have it. There. 102. 102. <laughs> <laughs> That's the pie. Uh, are you in? Yeah, I'm in. Oh, it's no one or two. One okay. or two. <sighs> <laughs> one or two. 
Uh, one That's no two. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? We have over five meters now. No. No, for the one. One more. We need a bigger one. One more. <laughs> I wanted you to stop fishing. We need, no. we need to. We you need said to one. Know. It was with. That's why. <laughs> one or two because they don't want us to stop fishing because yeah. they know they can I feel it. One or three. Okay. Whew. Nice one. Nice, nice, nice one. Oh yes, that's the one they've been searching for all afternoon. Fifth approved pike and a very nice one that is, giving Team Leech Gator a top 5 of 499 centimeters, snatching the point from Jigardotnu by a margin of half a meter. What's even more insane is that this pike is pike number 7 of the day, which means that they're also joining the number point club together with Headbanger, Daiva and Jigar. Never before in any competition have we had this many teams sharing a point. That's an impressive Grand Slam, Alex and Marcus. Number, big fish and top five. Look at this, masterpiece. Look, look, nice colors. We'll let her go, we'll let her grow. Okay, swim back. That was a glory turn, <laughs> a glory turn. Let's hope okay, this. Nice. It's a top five fish now, Alex. Alex yeah, but if the pike are eating, we can switch the 80 to, uh, to go over five meters. That would be amazing. Amazing, <sighs> three over a meter today. Yep. I can put it in there. Okay, we have like one hour left that we can fish. Then it will be too dark. So maximum one hour. Let's hope to pick that meter fish up so we can have a chance, what well, yeah. we think is a chance to get uh, one point today. Come on, Jacob. Yeah. Where are we? North Pole? <laughs> yeah, Northern Siberia. It's five o'clock, so we have one hour more to fish. So even if we get a one meter fish, I don't think it's going to be enough. But let's five. go for numbers. See if we can catch 10 in the yeah, last hour. Yeah, let's try it from the shallow water. Yeah, why not? Nu we? Nu we? Last hours. Yeah. We've been keep on hammering now the whole afternoon. We're freezing our ass off and we didn't catch jack shit the last two hours. I mean, I think it's the water temperature dropped so much that it made all the fishes go passive. Everything just went drop dead. It's really cold, the water is getting cold and all the pikes are standing still. Well, what should we do, Passy? I don't know, we fished for like 15 minutes more and uh, we're then... We're heading for the next place. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're not we getting the either. number point, we're not getting the top five point and, and uh, hats off to Leech and Gator for the big fish point. Yeah. Crazy. Hey, helt slut alltså. I'm really tired in my head. Uh, today I, I'm f***ed up. I'm totally like that fish that just punched a hole through me. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm, I'm like, uh, it feels like I'm in a dream. And the, the, the main part is, I, I will tell you something. You know that I had a dream, like the night before, where a big pike, like two big like strikes. And that strike, and I'm not almost, sinking. because I, kn I, was, I was just the same. And, and it, it felt like it was from the dream. But I hope it doesn't come come through because you said the boat was sinking also <laughs> and yeah, then you the wake up what the f was that i what don't know you said it the boat was sinking and uh, then you wake up crazy what the f <laughs> alex quickly 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 turn 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 no 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 turn with the boat turn with the boat 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 wait wait now wait it's too late <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What the f did you do? I threw the rod in the water. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's on 70 <laughs> meters. Like, what the f? Oh, I'm too tired. Can we go home now? Yeah, we go home. Really? Yeah, we go home. I really don't want to fish anymore today. <laughs> <laughs> We have exactly one hour left to fish, but it started to rain and we got 40 millimeters rain on us uh, yesterday and I, I'm too tired. So see you on next episode.
Yeah. With a new rib <laughs> and lure and <laughs> uh, rod. <laughs> you, you're so stupid. <laughs> what the f? Another bicycle pump. A little bit of boom. Oh, little touch. Yep, baby. Biggest of the day. Biggest of the day. Smoking cigar. This one have to take it. Oh, uh, 77 centimeters. So we got our first on the paper, baby. Woohoo! I put it back. So, so, let's do it tomorrow. Let's do it tomorrow. And see you on episode five. We think I never fought this hard for pikes before. No, this has been insane. We still have this big problem of getting our car out of here, oh, and no. boat, and trailer, and, and, and ourselves. Yeah. We said one problem at a time. That yeah. problem is getting close now. It's getting real close. Okay, guys. <sighs> Thanks for watching Two Idiots in a snowstorm. <sighs> I've actually had fun. Yeah, it, it was fun. It was tough before the lunch report. There was like, what are we doing here? But then we started to catch fish, and when you catch fish, you forget about everything else, so... 4.49, I, I would say, it's not a bad result, uh, I would say. It's enough. You think so? Yeah. I don't think so, I but think so. I, we will see in a couple of months. Yeah, that, that's the fun part of it. Good job, buddy. Good job today. Good job. The teams are signing out one after the other and we still have four teams sharing the number point with seven pike. Raymarine and Daiva is one of them and they just got a few minutes left before it's time to call it a day. Oh, Buster! No, it's not to have. It slips? No, it's not a film. Yeah, small pike. Small pike. It is a small one indeed, but it might be the most important jack in the history of this competition. Pike number 8 for Raymarine Diva fishing team, and with that they're kicking off Team Gator, Jigar and Headbanger from the number point, taking it all by themselves. Well fought, Pat and Buster. This day is over, and um, uh, we caught, uh, I think, 8 pike. Yeah. A pike. We we could have had really good fishing. We had lots of strikes, but we didn't yeah. manage to get the pikes into the boat. Yeah. But uh, that's fishing. Yeah. You lost some big ones, uh, a couple of ones. Yeah. I don't but... even want to think about it. <laughs> no. <laughs> but everybody, tomorrow is a new day, yeah. and then we'll go up the river and try to catch the really big ones. So uh, don't miss out because tomorrow is going to be really exciting. Yeah, follow us and stay tuned. Cheers. Everything's so frozen, including me <laughs> and my toes. Still, this is better than any day on the office. That's for sure. Do you think there's even a slight chance that we get to keep our points? I would say no, because I think someone has taken the numbers. That shouldn't be too hard. And uh, our top five is sent enough. No. But you don't know. I was hoping for us to improve a bit more on the top five. Now we're gonna go home and have some reindeer soup and maybe a sauna. Yeah. Some rest. <laughs> <laughs> See you in episode five. Yeah. River day. That's our That's our thing. <laughs> our thing. Let's do this. Well. It wasn't an easy day. No, we stick to the plan though. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we, really we was... Uh... We, I mean, we, we fished hard. 10 hours, yeah. hard fishing, six fish. Well, it, it's fishing basically. It's, yeah. yeah. I mean, was, we, yeah. we were here for a good top five. We got a decent top four. <laughs> 295 or 95, 94 and some 80 fish, but it, yeah. we didn't get it all all the way there. But tomorrow is the day. Tomorrow is the day. Tomorrow is the day we're here for, I mean. Yeah. We have something really cool uh, coming up tomorrow. Yeah, it's gonna be like true river fishing. Yeah, and really, really yeah. river fishing. Yeah, it's it's gonna be nice. Yeah, super cool. And we actually have a quite good chance of our top three, oh, our three points tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, that's what, what we're gonna do. Yeah. At least we're gonna try to do it. I mean. Yeah, if everything goes... One big one, five good size, Yeah. and then... Numbers. Numbers. You don't want to miss that, really. You don't want to miss that. So. It's going to be river adventure. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Waiters on. <laughs> <laughs> See you. See you. What a day.
This has been crazy in so many ways. I don't even know where to start, but of course the highlight was the new all-time biggest pike caught in the history of Fly vs Jerk. 14.02 kilos and 126 centimeters caught by Mr. Big Pike himself. Alexander Lexen and his partner in crime, Marcus Malishevsky. Bagging a fish like that during a competition is simply not supposed to happen, but now that it did, you guys deserve it so much. And if this wasn't enough, Team Leech Gator also secured the top 5 point with a great result of 499cm, giving them 2 of the 3 points for Lake Day. They almost got the number point as well, but in the last minutes of the day, Raymarine Daiba caught one last pike, giving them the number point. Going into the final day, Team Leech Gator have 2 points, Raymarine Daiba 1 point, Vision 1 point and CWC 2 points. Whatever you do, make sure to tune in next week as we're entering the famous River Day. My name is Mille Pettersson and you're watching Fly vs Jerk 12. Now we're on the way for the third point. Quite tired now, but it's going to be good. I promise you. What? Oh, sorry. Huh? What do you say? I have the the, the full, full light. light. I know. I see you. Yeah. Okay, guys. See you in one week now. <laughs>